But this truck used to have rats' nests in it and birds' nests in it and was, was, was found in sort of a field. To see this now, it takes you all the way back. And it were, they were comfortable little trucks, weren't they? Yeah. You know, it, the icy blast outside at Wigan or somewhere, <laughs> yes. and you were sitting in here. And it, 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 it is a comfortable, cosy thing. What do you think, Jane? I like these trucks. Coming back into them, you realise that you're actually a lot closer to one another, yeah. other yeah. departments. You're not yelling or on the phone. I don't have to as many buttons as I used to. But, no. you know, at the end, but these trucks are built to do the job we asked them to do at the time, and yeah. this, the fact that they're still doing it now is astonishing. Astonishing, think, really. And so I have to say, sometimes I think it, this is cleaner than some of the ones I worked in <laughs> at the time. <laughs> and envision they drove the cameras beautifully because it, they work. They, these cameras have to be driven. It's usually a man per camera, and they drive them like a like a, a finely tuned racing car to get the best out of them. Because the sing the signal coming from the camera has to be refined till it's presented to me. And there's a huge camaraderie down throughout yeah. throughout the truck, yeah. and everybody's really enjoyed what's gone on. It, it was it was a sort of a unique experience because of course yeah. it was a long time ago that we, we ever touched any of these. So na nowadays the modern cameras are so much lighter, more reliable. I would say uh, either I was a better cameraman then, or these need more restoration. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I ne never thought I would, uh, the last time I pointed, you know, it, it, it looks at one of these and tried to get it working was probably 38 years ago. Very evocative uh, looking at that chart. We spent yeah. hours in our youth looking that, at the black that and white chart. That was the chart. thing, that was the, that was the missing yeah, you know, discipline. To see that in the viewfinder yesterday was yeah. bloody hell. <laughs> And you then, know, yeah. and to actually get the sun, trying to remember which tube was which and what you were tweaking. And then, then the engineer said, what we actually need is a bit of red, red vertical linearity. And so I opened the, opened the back up here and thinking, it's one of those. <laughs> and thinking, yeah, just a minute. Yeah, it was on the skew board. And we used to normally have a little screwdriver used to live in here. And I thought, and I found it. <laughs> red vertical linearity is there. And I found it and tweaked it, and he said, "Yeah, that's it. You've done it. That's the that's that's, that's done the problem." And uh, if you'd asked me ten minutes earlier, I couldn't have remembered where it was. But when you actually stand there again, and that was that was quite um, that was quite satisfying. Good to do for that. the memories, but you can't remember. No, what I can't remember what breakfast. I did yesterday, but I remember <laughs> where red linearity, the vertical <laughs> linearity was. Well, I just sort of went up here. Oh yes, I remembered what it did. And yeah, 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 yeah. Some of the bits don't work, but things like. Uh, we had an issue with the red signal from camera three not getting here and it was going through the process of well where where are we losing the signal we we could see it there we could see it on the end there but it wasn't getting here and so we then went around the back into the cab and unplugged it and then fed a wire through well can we see it on the end of that piece of cable no we can't ah well, it's broken between here and that. Right, we're not going to be able to fix that. What can we do? So what we did, we took the colour bar signal out of this coder and put the camera signal into the colour bar input and switched it to colour bars. So we've no, no longer got colour bars on this coder, but we've got pictures. The last time I used one of these in anger was probably about 30 years ago. Uh, but it all comes back. You, I don't know what it is. It sort of sinks in. You, you get so used to operating things, and it just sinks in, and you come back. And it's like an old friend. You think, oh yes. And then you remember all the times it got you out of trouble, and you remember all the times it got you into trouble. I'm trying to remember where everything went with these with these old cameras, which you hadn't seen for so long. I mean, putting it together mechanically was all right. You remembered how to do it. Yeah. The biggest frustration about it all was waiting for it to light up and see if you could see anything. Yeah. Seriously, yeah. you know, it was just, yeah, yeah. Yeah. are we, yeah, good yeah. God, it's there. Yeah. That, that was um, the nice bit. Yeah, yeah. There is a picture. Yeah. To not actually a, get them. Not a challenge, it, yeah. it was a joy. Yeah, to, to get to see them working and remembering how you sort of operated it, you know, 40 years ago. You know. And the bits you didn't like about <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 40 but, years but, ago. Um, yeah, I'm thinking, I never imagined I'd ever be standing here um, trying something. to make a, even a sort of a pretend programme 40 years later with the gear and it sort of worked you know which is um, I think a testament to the gear that it's you know, and the people that have you know lovingly restored it and that you know which we, yeah, you know uh, and and also the fact that we sort of remembered what we were doing yeah. 40 years ago. We didn't get here today <laughs> <laughs> by looking forward to doing it 40 years no, ago. No, no, yeah.
Yeah, I'm amazed actually that um, these guys who have not seen the equipment for well, some of them, so you told me you left the BBC in 1977, and that was, a, that was about a year before I joined. Yeah. <laughs> and since he's actually looked at this kit, he's seen it, and he was actually within 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 minutes almost. He was, uh, you know, he was in there on the back of the bays, uh, plugging up things or whatever. And it's it's almost encouraging, isn't it? It's all there in your mind. Yeah, it's just a matter of accessing it, really. Yes. And it was the light in their eyes as well when they saw the equipment that was uh, yeah. I found amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Perhaps they didn't appreciate mm. how close we could have been yes. to a total disaster where we had nothing, nothing at coming all, out at right, all, where yes, the whole yes. thing shut down. You know, if these SPG, I mean, that yeah. that scared me. The first thing was when that Emmy went off. Yes, of course. And, and, it was and I thought, yeah. no, all the weeks of work yeah. I put into doing it, we're going to end up just using an Ikigami. In yeah. some ways, it was a miracle that I, I couldn't believe it. We got four cameras working, Absolutely. you know, yeah. like, it, yeah. with sort of rolling humbars yeah. sort of yeah. yeah. all day. <laughs> but, but it did work. You know, after a fashion. So I, I think we managed to sort of cover the when we had problems between us. We managed to find the solutions of the sort that we would have found forty well, odd years yeah, ago. Yeah. Well, well, yeah. 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 But it gradually yeah. came back. Yeah. But some of the detail, didn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah. Quite, quite a lot of them in there somewhere. Yeah. But yeah. we'd have probably only had one of those issues on a yes. program. Yes, so I think for everybody, failure was not an option. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's right. Yeah. I think we all yeah. would let yeah. the team down. Yeah. Yeah. You would let the But yes. it, was, it was obviously you didn't want the program to fail. You didn't want to fail in front of your yeah. friends. Yeah. 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 to tell you that you'd gone wrong. You felt yes. absolutely yes. Oh, horrible yeah. yourself. Yeah. 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 You had a yeah. feeling that mm. maybe you mm. made yeah. a mistake. I think that the memory I'll take away from this is the fact that we were given a deadline for effectively what was going to be a live transmission mm. and as that as the clock ticked round mm. and, and Jane started to count us in yeah. at the beginning of that program I felt yeah. that uh, the years rolled back and we <laughs> yeah. were all suddenly working as a team the adrenaline yeah. was flowing yeah. Yeah. and for 20 minutes we were all focused on yeah. making it work yeah. 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 And, and then there was this wonderful relief afterwards <laughs> and this sort of self-congratulatory yeah. program, program. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, this program. euphoria yeah. 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 in the past would have taken us straight down the pub for a, a, a good old yeah. chinwag yeah. Yeah.